Hi friends, I am Yash. We do a lot of activities such as playing, running, jumping, reading, etc. Where does the body get the energy from? And how does it get the energy? We get the energy and nutrients from the food that we eat. In this video, let us talk about how food is digested in the human body, parts of human digestive system and their functions, and how to take care of human digestive system, etc. Friends, if you have not yet subscribed, please click on subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get regular updates. The food passes through more than 22 feet of tubing called the digestive system. Digestive system breaks down the food into small molecules, out of which the useful ones are absorbed by blood and sent throughout our body. This process of breaking down of food into small absorbable nutrients is called digestion. Digestive system also plays a key role in removing of waste material from the body. Components of the digestive system The digestive system is made up of elementary canal the liver, the gallbladder, and the pancreas. The elementary canal is also called the digestive tract. It is a long tube of organs which includes the mouth, the pharynx, the esophagus, the stomach, small intestine, large intestine, and anus. Process of Digestion Your digestive system starts working much before the food touches your mouth and works for hours after you eat your food. The process of digestion starts when the brain instructs the salivary glands to prepare for digesting the food. The mouth forms saliva as soon as you smell, see, or think about food. The teeth tear and chop the food into small pieces. Tongue facilitates the movement of food in the mouth and helps in the process of chewing. Saliva moistens the food and the enzymes present in saliva converts the carbohydrates such as starch into sugar. Swallowing is done by muscle movements of the tongue and mouth, which move the food into the throat or pharynx. The pharynx is a passageway for food and air. From the throat, food travels down a muscular tube in the chest called esophagus. Through the esophagus, the food reaches a sac-like organ 
the stomach. The stomach muscles churn and mix the food with acids and enzymes. The enzymes break down the food into much smaller digestible particles. What are enzymes? Enzymes are special type of proteins. The enzymes break down the food into small molecules that can be absorbed in blood. By the time the food is ready to leave the stomach, it is processed into a thick liquid called chyme. The chyme squirts into the small intestine from the stomach. The small intestine is the longest part of the elementary canal. It is fitted into a compact space because of extensive coiling. This is the main site of food digestion. It receives juices from the liver and the pancreas which helps in digestion of carbohydrates, proteins and fats. The complete digestion of carbohydrates, proteins and fats takes place in the small intestine. Food stays in small intestine for up to 4 hours by the end of which most nutrients pass from intestine to the blood and the undigested food from the small intestine is sent to large intestine. The main function of the large intestine is to remove water from the undigested matter and form solid waste that can be excreted. The solid waste is called as feces, is then stored in the rectum until it is excreted via the anus. Pancreas, liver, and gallbladder. Pancreas, liver, and gallbladder are three important organs apart from the elementary canal that aid in the process of digestion. Liver performs several key functions in the process of digestion. Some of the functions are production of bile, removal of waste and toxins from the body, and storing of some minerals and vitamins. The bile helps the body to absorb fats and thus help in digestion of fats. Bile produced by the liver is stored in the gallbladder until it is needed. The pancreas produces a mix of enzymes called pancreatic juice that helps in digestion of proteins, fats and carbohydrates. It also makes a substance that reduces the acidity of chyme. Let us have a quick recap of digestive system in humans. Mouth breaks down the food into small particles that can pass through the pharynx and esophagus. Salivary glands moistens and lubricates the food and thus help in the process of swallowing. Pharynx through which we can swallow. Esophagus, it transports the food to stomach. Stomach, 
churn and mix the food with acids and enzymes. Enzymes breaks down the food into much smaller digestible pieces and forms churn. Small intestine. This is the main site of food digestion. It takes care of complete digestion of carbohydrates, proteins, and fats. Liver takes care of production of bile, removal of waste material and toxins from the body, and storing of some minerals and vitamins. Gallbladder. It stores bile until it is needed. The pancreas produces a mix of enzymes called pancreatic juice that helps in digestion of proteins, fats, and carbohydrates. Large intestine. It takes care of removal of water from the undigested matter. and form solid waste that can be excreted anus it is the opening for elimination of feces your stomach is a home to nearly 400 different types of microorganisms called bacteria Most of these bacteria are useful bacteria which helps in the process of digestion. Our stomach and intestines are filled with lots of bacteria like this. Curd or yogurt contain a different type of bacteria or microorganisms that are associated with beneficial effects to humans and other animals. Consuming curd or yogurt helps in improving digestion. How to take care of this digestive system? Bad digestion is a root cause to number of health problems and illnesses. So it is important to eat healthy food and maintain good eating habits to stay healthy. To take care of digestive system, chew well when you eat. Eat a lot of green vegetables, fruits and salads. Do not sleep immediately after eating food. Avoid eating too spicy, sour, oily and sugary food. Avoid eating refrigerated stale food items. Avoid drinking cold water. Lukewarm water is the best for digestion. Friends, if you have not yet subscribed, please click on subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get regular updates.